Hey there folks, Baltasaro back again with another exciting edition of Pokemon Emerald. In the last part, we made it here uh, somewhere between uh, Fortree City and Lily Cove. Uh, we got done with a bunch of side quests, and now we're back on our way through our journey. I'm going to throw a potion on Kushala before we avoid another double battle. Mwahaha! If you don't pay attention, you can get hurt! This never happened to me before. I've never been hurt. Ever. Just kidding. So here we have Meditite, actually kind of a cool type alignment. I psychic and fighting. I actually kind of like it. Eh, of course. Nah, let's just air cutter. Of course, I got a flying type, so you're dead. It's super effective. It's a me. I guess a Mario is back. <laughs> Please excuse my silliness. You're gonna use Makuhito. Well, I'm just gonna roll. Genka's just gonna roll all over you then. Screw Kushala. I'm just gonna throw Genka out there and rock your stuff. I'm gonna, you're not even going to get a move off. Just don't even throw your damn Pokemon out. Just don't. I mean, I feel bad for you. Like, I just I just feel bad, because you're just, you're just gone. War. Such a, such a cute little thing. Oh, it's dead. It's even cuter when it's fainted. I always enjoy that little... I always enjoy it. It's fainted, you know. Never, never just like, you know... Makuhito was beaten to a bloody pulp. Never that. It's always just oh, like 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 it saw like you know like it saw its shadow or something. Like the thing got the hell beaten out of it. It fainted. It was knocked out. It's unconscious. Like this thing needs immediate medical attention. That's what it should say when like phone and Kata needs immediate me medical attention. That's that's the re that's realistic Pokemon right there. Anyways, I'm gonna stop being silly, and you know play the damn game. And here we get Fury Swipes. Takes forever. Critical hit. It hit three. Oh, it hit three times. Oh, you see, now that's very deceiving because it goes, sh -sh -sh. it thinks, it, you make it think, it, it makes you think. Wow, I'm having a lot of trouble with English today. But thank God the game can count for me because I just don't have the time. I just do not have the time to count anymore. We have coffee. Oh shit! I didn't mean. I meant meant to switch, but you know what? Who cares? Meant to switch to Ganko. Why not? Let keep Kushala out there. Kushala's got a face for TV. Damn looking sprite. Of course, so does Gardevoir. But and you know, no. Oh, I only got to do that 68 more times, and you got me knocked out. God. Let's see what Swift does. Critical hit. I like it. I like it a lot. Kushala gets some experience, and so does Alfredo. <laughs> Laughing at Fisha Sorrow again. You'll have to excuse me. Let's keep on moving on here. <clears throat> excuse me. Pokemon have many special abilities. If you want to become a first-class trainer, learn about them. Okay. Like, I've never... That's the first thing you say to... That's the first thing you ever say to me? Like, how about hi? Like, you have ever noticed that? No one ever, like, you've never met these people before. Like, they just come up and give you, like, you know, a, a one one or two liner and then... Oh, well, okay, just do that. Sableye, I believe the first Pokemon to not have a weakness. I think I've actually talked sh Oh, I've talked shit about this thing before. Yeah, oh, oh, it failed? Okay. You know, some people like, you know, people like it. Other people don't. I'm I'm one of the people that doesn't. Its base stats, in my opinion, just aren't there. The lack of you know the lack of ability, the lack of I should say the lack of strength just just kills it in that case. But of course I can understand why they. I mean, like that's the reason they made Gyarados Water Flying instead of Water Dragon. If it was Water Dragon, it would have just been weak to. Wouldn't have been weak. To, it would have been weak to Dragon. So I mean. And its stats are ridiculous, so I can understand why they would why they would shy away from doing that. Um, I don't think there's anything up there. I don't have Cut Flash with me, so I'm not gonna bother. Uh, if there's something, you know, of of interest up there, I'll throw it on the screen. Apart from that, I'm not even gonna bother looking it up or even telling you guys about it. But for now, we're just gonna run through here, and eh, there's a. Another hidden Pokemon down there. I'm just gonna go around it. I'll check your Pokemon and see if they're fit for the outdoors. Thank you so much. You know, that's very nice of you. P 
Pokemon Ranger Lorenzo. Anyways, it is raining, as it often is. And we trace Chlorophyll. I'm not 100% sure what that even does. We're just going to use Psychic and not even worry about it. Goodbye. Foci faints. There's some experience to be gained. Some Newsleaf. Will we change Pokemon? Yes, we will, because we will remember that C dot is half dark for the first time in my entire life. Wow, this is this is a this is a this is a big day, folks, in the history of Balthasaro. I actually remember that the C dot. I mean, that Newsleaf is half dark type. Wow, I. I'd, I'd, I'd like to thank I'd like to thank Bulbapedia for for telling me that it was half dark type when I used a psychic move and it told me that it didn't affect it <laughs> I'd like to thank <laughs> I'd like to thank my parents oh, sorry I'm being ridiculous now and yeah of course you flinch come on really really I mean you know you're done oh my and it misses how does it miss how does it miss, damn it? See, now I'm just getting pissy as rain continues to fall. But, you know, we got this in the bag. I'm not even going to worry about it. You see? It hit eventually. And actually, that reminds me. We got that TM for Aerial Ace a thousand years ago. I guess by a thousand years ago, I mean, you know, a video ago. You're going to use Lombre. Well, now we're going to switch to our old girl Genka. I'm um, actually meant to give Kushala Aerial Ace. I'm pretty sure Skarmory doesn't learn that on its own. So I will be using that TM on Kushala probably immediately after this battle, if I remember. Which I probably won't. And we'll just we'll just use Psychic. Get this... Oh my god. Come on. And Genka flinches. Of course. Of course. Genka flinches, you know. But it's quality time. You know, we get to spend some time together. What you guys like, right? You guys like to spend some time with the old Baltasaro, eh? And Alfredo. Alfredo is... You're, you're gaining too many levels, dude. Of course, I will probably... Bar none, stop with the experience share at level... Damn it. Level 35, just because that's when... Then we find a nugget. I've got, I've got a thousand money items I need to unload. Um, but that just reminds me... And Did I go the right way here? Yes, I did. Repel's effect wears off. See if I care. I'm gonna keep running down here. And what do you have to say? What's down? What are you? I guess we'll. Well, screw it. We'll fight you. And then what in the hell was I saying? I have no idea what I was talking about. Wow, has that ever happened to you guys? You're just in the middle of something, and then you just have no idea what you're talking about. Wow, that's embarrassing. Well, well, geez, I. Sorry, I guess. I guess I'll I'll put up on the screen. I guess I'll complete my thought on on the screen there. I have no idea what I was talking about. Oh yeah, Trap Inch will evolve at level 35, so bar none. Oh nice, confusion actually working in my favor for once. Oh wait, what the hell? I don't want to change Pokemon. But yeah, when when Alfredo evolves, we'll take we'll take the experience share off and and just and you know just give it to someone else just for the sake of. Not having a huge disparity between between our our Pokemon's levels, and there we go. Thank you, random number generator, for finally for giving me giving me uh, sparing us a turn. And well, this guy's a lot of shitty Pokemon. Pardon my language. I mean, it's not even it's one crappy Pokemon three times. Dude, you know you gotta expand your horizons. And random number generator comes through again. Almost a waste of time. We got no experience from that, and I don't feel like I said anything interesting. Yep, and of course we register this terrible trainer in our Pokenav. Why the hell not? Actually, I think I did go the right way. Oh yeah. Hey, hey Ryan, can you see that dead end over there? Yeah, that's that's a dead end. You're not. That's not going to take you anywhere. Anyways, you talk to this girl. Berries grow by soaking up sunlight. We help the berries grow by watering them regularly. It's an expression of love, isn't it? You should take this. And we get the wiki berry. I think that berry is rare. I hope you raise it with loving care. Actually, it is quite rare. Sorry about that, guys. I had to cut away for a second. Actually, this getting this berry was pretty advantageous. Uh, this girl gives you a different rare berry 
based on the last number of your trainer ID. We got the wiki berry, which is an indigo berry, which help definitely helps us out with trying to trying to raise our Feebas's beauty stat. So I should be getting to use that pretty soon. But for now, let's head on. I don't think those berries over there were all that important. We have we can avoid a double battle here. And actually, here let me use some items really quick. Just th uh, just threw some super potions onto Genka and I believe Aaron. They were running kind of low. Anyways, we get <laughs> probably one of the funniest sprites I've seen in the entire game. Hex Maniac, Tammy, and of course we have a Psychic type going up against this Dark type. So we're gonna we're gonna fix that really quick. And of course you have Levitate, so I can't just use Elton. Figure, excuse me, figures. Anyways, you're gonna what? Oh, that's stupid. I've never seen that done before. I don't know. I guess. Oh, that's right. Pursuit. God damn it. Pursuit. Pardon my language. Pursuit is an increased priority move. It actually, uh, I believe it actually all actually does more damage if the Pokemon is switching out. So that's an interesting move. Actually pretty smart considering, I don't know, you might want to lead with a Psychic type like I did. Kinda cool. But nonetheless, we use Air Cutter, and of course I forgot to teach Kushala Aerial Ace figures. And Kushala grows to level 32, very nice. And you're trying to learn Steel Wing, I'm glad I didn't waste that TM. Eh, what are we gonna get rid of here? Eh, I kinda like having a... we'll place that with Aerial Ace. We'll get rid of Sand Attack. I kind of like having Swift. It's a nice, you know, alternate move. Some, need something normal typed, so... And Alfredo will get some... And we'll leave Kushal out there, why not? And you're going to use Shuppet, and I'm not going to care. Let's try out our new move here. I don't believe there's any sort of problem using Steel Attacks on a Dark type. T there is not a critical hit. Beautifully done. Kushal gets some more experience, and we defeat <laughs> weird-looking dork Tammy. I have lost. Everyone's British now. All my accents are of British people. Can't you see that I have all this stuff with me? Despite that, you still insist that we battle. Yep, I'm a f I'm just a little fucker like that. And you are a bug maniac. So another terrible dork. And he has a dust ox. We're gonna use Genka and just just rock this poor thing's shiz. Not even we're not even gonna screw around. We're just gonna use Psychic. Could have probably could have gotten away with confusion, but it's a bug type. I just love poning the bug types. And I'm gonna use Beautifly and basically Generation 3's uh, equivalents of Beedrill and Butterfree. We're gonna use Psychic again. Just massive overkill just for the sake of massively overkilling. I mean, you were such an asshole to me when I tried to battle you. Like, most of the time, like, half the time, like, you fuckers could just jump out in my way. Like, yeah, I want to freaking battle you guys. But with that in mind, I'm not sh Oh, wait. We are actually getting pretty close to the Safari Zone, which is something that I will want to talk about in the next part. So we are going to have to call it a day here. I am Baltasaro, of course, if you didn't already know. If you like this video, uh, definitely like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And definitely, you know, go back and check out the previous ones if you haven't seen those. And of course, if you do one thing, come back next time. The next time on Pokemon Emerald, we're going to keep going over here. Hell, we're going to fight this girl. And we're going to check out the Safari Zone before getting to Lily Cove City and leveling up our Feebas. I am Baltasaro. If you have some sort of hearing problem or short attention span and didn't know that, I love you guys and I will be seeing you next time.